NROTC Units Spring Review and Midshipman Change of Command. I am Midshipman First Class Brianna Wildman. I am a senior from Middletown, Rhode Island, studying political science in the College of Arts and Sciences. We are pleased that you could join us today. I would like to take this opportunity to recognize the members of the Villanova NROTC classes of 1967 through 1971 who are in the audience today, and all of our alumni in the audience. I would like to thank them for showing their support to the battalion and ask that they stand and be recognized. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the invocation given by Father Joseph Calderon, OSA Chaplain and Counselor to the Villanova School of Law. Let us pray. Gracious God, once again we gather to celebrate your generosity and the many blessings that you have bestowed on the NROTC program here at Villanova University. The team here has accomplished many difficult tasks with skill, energy, and professionalism. They're part of what takes this battalion, this makes this battalion shine, an integral part of a team. All of us together contribute to the needs of the team to complete its overall mission. So today I pray, eternal God, Protect in your care all persons involved in trying to bring an end to senseless violence and death in our country and in our world. Give guidance and safety-mindedness to all our forces deployed around the globe. Help each member of our battalion this day look not only at our own direct responsibilities, but also around to take shared responsibility for all we do. May our actions contribute to and not deter from the reality of peace in our world. Amen. Thank you, Father Calderon. Ladies and gentlemen, please be seated.
Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for honors to the Commanding General, Marine Corps Recruiting Command, Brigadier General Robert E. Milstead, Jr., and remain standing for the playing of the National Anthem. Ladies and gentlemen, please be seated. I would now like to introduce the Battalion Commander, Midshipman First Class Samantha Carnahan. Midshipman Carnahan is from Starver, Pennsylvania, and is a senior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying comprehensive science. She has been designated a Surface Warfare Officer and will report to the USS Higgins DDG-76 this summer.
about 70, uh, 65 to 70 percent of our core is under the age of 25, most of which populate that beloved rank of the plants global. We have over 26,000 teenagers. Those are the men and women that you will lead. They're the finest that this nation has to offer. And they've often been described. Today we will recognize the outstanding achievements of individual midshipmen. The Driscoll Endowed Memorial Scholarship Grant is presented to an outstanding Marine Option midshipman who epitomizes enthusiasm, teamwork, esprit de, and esprit de corps in a prospective junior officer. The award is given in memory of Captain Thomas P. Driscoll, United States Marine Corps a Harrier pilot and graduate of Villanova NROTC class of 1987. Presenting the award is Mr. Dan Driscoll, brother of Captain Driscoll. This year's grant is awarded to Midshipman Second Class Gabriel Galansky. Midshipman Galansky is from Ridgefield, Connecticut and is a junior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying psychology. Father Lawrence C. Gallen, OSA Memorial Sword, is presented to an outstanding senior midshipman based on leadership, academics, and esprit de corps. Presenting the sword is Father Cale Ellis, Dean of the College of Arts and Sciences. The Father Gallen Sword recipient this year is Midshipman First Class Jonathan Perkins. Midshipman Perkins is from Simsbury, Connecticut, and is a senior in the College of Engineering studying mechanical engineering. In addition, Midshipman Perkins has been selected as the Chief of Naval Operations Distinguished Midshipman Graduate for Villanova University. Commander Alexander G. Severance, Jr., United States Naval Reserve Memorial Sword, is presented by the Severance family, Villanova classmates, shipmates, and friends in memory of Commander Severance, who is a 1958 Villanova graduate. The award is given to an outstanding senior midshipman based on academic and naval aptitude who has chosen Navy naval aviation as a career. Presenting the sword is Mrs. Severance, wife of Commander Severance.
This year, the award is presented to Midshipman First Class Molly LeBlanc. Midshipman LeBlanc is from Stafford, Virginia, and is a senior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying psychology. Midshipman LeBlanc will also receive the Marine Corps Association Honor Graduate Award, which is awarded to the top senior Marine option in the battalion. The Philadelphia chapter of the Service Navy Association recognizes the graduating midshipman who has demonstrated excellence in preparation for service as a surface warfare officer. Presenting the award is Rear Admiral Jack Sweeney, United States Navy Reserve, retired. This year's recipient of the Philadelphia NROTC Surface Warfare Sword is Midshipman First Class Samantha Carnahan. The Military Order of Foreign Wars Award is presented to an outstanding midshipman for exceptional service to the battalion and their community. This year's recipient of the Military Order of Foreign Wars Award is Midshipman First Class Samantha Carnahan. The Smedley D. Butler Detachment of the United States Marine Corps League will present the annual Gung Ho Award, an encased United States Marine Corps K-Bar fighting knife to the Villanova midshipmen that worked the hardest to obtain a Marine Corps commission. Presenting the award is Mr. Earl Drake, Commandant of the Smedley Butler Detachment. This year's recipient is Midshipman First Class Paul Caparasso. Midshipman Caparasso is from Howell, New Jersey, and is a senior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying criminal justice. Lieutenant Frank A. Young, United States Marine Corps Memorial Sword, which is presented by the Young family in memory of First Lieutenant Young, a Marine pilot and 1980 Villanova graduate. The award is presented to an outstanding senior Marine option midshipman. Presenting the award is Mr. Frank Young, Lieutenant Young, Young's father. The Young family also presents the overall Drill Meet Championship Trophy at the annual Military Excellence Competition held at Villanova. This year's recipient of the Young Memorial Sword is Midshipman First Class Paul Caparasso. Anastasia C. Powers, Tom Agnew Jr. Memorial Sword 
recognizes a first-class midshipman who demonstrates superior leadership potential and esprit de corps. The award is sponsored by the Powers family, who has been affiliated with Villanova University since 1953 and is given in memory of Anastasia Powers and Tom Agnew. Presenting the sword is Mr. Robert Powers, a Villanova alumnus and longtime supporter of the Villanova University NROTC program. This year's recipient is Midshipman First Class William Laverty. Midshipman Laverty is from Chester, New Jersey, and is a senior in the School of Business, studying business management. The Department of Pennsylvania Marine Corps League Semper Fi Award recognizes a midshipman who has demonstrated the ability to overcome adversity. He is being presented with a case K-Bar fighting knife. Presenting the award is Mr. Tom Tanner. This year's recipient is Midshipman First Class William Laverty. The Lieutenant Junior Grade Michael J. DiPartolomeo United States Navy Memorial Sword is presented by the DiPartolomeo family in memory of their son Michael, a naval aviator and 1981 Villanova graduate. The award is presented to an outstanding graduating Navy option midshipman who has been selected for naval flight training based on academic average, aptitude grades, and contributions to the NROTC unit. Presenting the award is Stephen Areco, a cousin of Lieutenant DiPartolomeo. Receiving the award is Midshipman First Class, Jonathan Cleveland. Midshipman Cleveland is from Gaithersburg, Maryland, and is a senior in the College of Engineering, studying mechanical engineering. The Navy League's Gerard M. Maurer Memorial Sword Award recognizes the senior midshipman who has demonstrated excellence in academics and leadership. Mr. Maurer, a 1949 graduate of Villanova University, was an ardent supporter of the Navy League. Presenting the award is Rear Admiral Maurer, class of 1976, son of Gerard Maurer. The Philadelphia Council of the Navy League of the United States award, awards this year's sword to Midshipman First Class Jacqueline Reed. Midshipman Reed is from Ridgefield, Connecticut and is a senior in the College of Nursing. for the presentation of the Riley Sword for Leadership Communications. The 2009 sword is presented in honor of Rear Admiral John Sweeney, United States Navy retired. General Milstead will present the sword to this year's recipient, Midshipman First Class Robert Ahern. Midshipman Ahern is from Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania, and is a senior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying criminal justice. This is the 
second year that the Jessica Falcone Memorial Sword will be presented. It is presented in memory of Miss Jessica Falcone, a 1998 graduate of Villanova. The sword is presented to honor the courage and inspiration she showed in her battle with acute lymphatic le leukemia. Presenting the award is her father, Captain Frank E. Falcone, United States Navy, retired. This year's recipient is Midshipman First Class, Angela Lawrence. Midshipman Lawrence is from Pasadena, California, and is a senior in the College of Nursing. The Association of Naval Aviation, Lieutenant Matthew T. Clark, United States Navy Memorial Sword, is presented in memory of Lieutenant Clark, a F-14 pilot and 1986 Villanova graduate. The sword is given to an outstanding graduating midshipman who has been selected for naval flight training and exhibits superior leadership, aptitude, and academic achievement. Presenting the sword is General Milston. This year's recipient is Midshipman First Class, Josh Dufour. Midshipman Dufour is from Oswego, New York, and is a senior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying criminal justice. The Military Officers Association of America Philadelphia Chapter Award recognizes a senior with outstanding leadership and aptitude. This year's award is presented by Captain Tom Prendergast, United States Navy retired, to Midshipman First Class Alan Fritchie. Midshipman Fritchie is from Millstone, New Jersey, and is a senior in the College of Engineering studying electrical engineering. The Naval Submarine League Admiral Frederick B. Water Award is awarded to an outstanding first class midshipman who has been approved for training and service in submarines. This year's award is being presented by General Milstead to Midshipman First Class Stephen Graham. Midshipman Graham is from Royal Oak, Maryland and is a senior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying physics. The Military Order of World Wars Awards recognizes midshipmen for superior performance in their duties within the battalion. This year's awards are presented by Captain John Belisari, United States Marine Corps. This year's recipients are Leadership Award, Midshipman Second Class, Rachel Kohler. Midshipman Kohler is from Percocy, Pennsylvania, and is a junior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying chemistry. Gold Medal, Midshipman Second Class, Richard Haley. Midshipman Haley is from Smithtown, New York, and is a junior in the College of Engineering, studying civil engineering. Silver medal. Midshipman 3rd Class, Julian D'Orsenio. 
Midshipman D'Arsenio is from Elverson, Pennsylvania, and is a sophomore in the College of Engineering, studying mechanical engineering. Bronze medal, Midshipman, fourth class, Ian McDonough. Midshipman McDonough is from New Fairfield, Connecticut, and is a freshman in the College of Nursing, studying nursing. The Military Officers Association of America Valley Forge Chapter Award recognizes a second-class midshipman who shows exceptional potential for military leadership. This year's award will be presented by Lieutenant Colonel Jeff Flipson, United States Marine Corps, and awarded to Midshipman Second Class John Steele. Midshipman Steele is from Simsbury, Connecticut, and is a junior in the College of Arts and Sciences studying geography. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Please join me in a round of applause for our award recipients. I would also like to take this opportunity to thank our award presenters at this ceremony and the numerous groups that have supported us throughout the year, specifically those who have financially supported our midshipmen through the P.J. Harrington Memorial Fund, which is used to support midshipmen travel to conferences and competitions throughout the year. The Color Platoon Pennant is awarded each semester to the platoon that excels as a unit in academics, physical fitness, drill, and teamwork. The winner of the Spring 2009 Color Platoon Competition is Alpha One. Today also marks the end of the semester for the Villanova University NROTC unit. Accordingly, we have incorporated the official midshipman change of command ceremony into today's proceedings. The outgoing battalion commander is midshipman first class Samantha Carnahan, 21 April 2009. From commanding officer, Villanova University Naval ROTC unit. To Midshipman First Class, Samantha Carnahan. Subject, change of command. Midshipman Carnahan, as of 15:30, 21 April 2009, you are hereby relieved of duties as Battalion Commander of the Villanova NROTC Unit. Samantha, you have done a great job in this challenging billet, and the experience gained will certainly serve you well in the fleet. I wish you continued success in your short time remaining at Villanova and your future in the United States Navy. Signed, Brian Manthe, Colonel, United States Marine Corps. The incoming battalion commander is Midshipman Sec Second Class, 
Richard Haley. 21 April 2009, from Commanding Officer, Villanova University Naval ROTC Unit, to Midshipman Second Class Richard Haley. Subject, Change of Command. Midshipman Haley, as of 1530, 21 April 2009, you are hereby appointed as Battalion Commander of the Villanova NROTC Unit. Richard, I have every confidence that you will continue to build upon the strong traditions set by those who have come before you. Keep up your hard work, and you are ensured great success in this challenging job. Congratulations and best of luck. Signed, Brian Manthe, Colonel, United States Marine Corps. The passing of the colors between commanders is symbolic of the transfer of responsibility and authority between commanders. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the playing of the service songs. Ladies and gentlemen, this concludes the 2009 Spring Awards Ceremony and Change of Command. You are cordially invited to join the staff and battalion of midshipmen for a reception to the left of the seating area. Award presenters are invited to take a picture with their respective midshipmen awardee. Thank you once again for being with us today on this special occasion.